that is the shirataki spaghetti. Here's the package it came in. Tofu shirataki spaghetti shaped noodles. From House Foods. These are gluten free. They are a source of fiber, no cholesterol, no trans fat. They are fully vegetarian and they are guilt free. Which is a thing that I didn't know. It says not to freeze it though. So don't buy it and then freeze it. They do stay for a long time. Here are the nutrition facts. Half of a package is 20 calories, 0.5 grams of fat, 3 grams of carbohydrates, two of which come from fiber, and one comes from protein. There's no sugar. That's pretty badass. So a full package is 40. This is one package. This huge, okay, here's my hand. Here it is in my hand. That's one package. That's 40. So you can have like a huge that's bowl. Two package. Oh, that's two packages? Yeah. Oh, never mind. That's two packages. And my wife and I get to share that. Even if I ate that all by myself, that huge ball, it would still only be 80 calories. Now, to compare the Kamut spaghetti that we eat, which was the lowest calorie count we found in a noodle, is for 85 grams, 260 calories. That's 85 grams. This is, oh, thank the Lord, it's in grams. For 226 grams, 226 grams, you have 40 calories. So, definitely a miracle, this noodle. This is the one that's made with tofu. If you have just miracle noodles, the shirataki root, that's zero calories. You can eat as much as you want. So, now, we're going to boil them for three minutes to try and get rid of the rubbery texture. And uh, then we're going to add something else I found that was amazing. I'm, I'm wondering if it might be a typo because I've never seen anything this low. But this is a bolognese sauce that I found at my favorite grocery store. It's called Italiano, and it's the bolognese sauce. And uh, I don't know if you can see this, but one cup, probably not, one cup or 100 grams is 60 calories. One cup is a lot. Just to put that into perspective, let's say you got uh, a marinara sauce from... Paul Newman or Classico. Uh, what you normally get from those sauces, like this one, is half a cup is 70 calories. So there's more calories in half a cup of this than there is in a full cup of that bolognese sauce. Now, we haven't tried the bolognese sauce. It could be terrible. But I'm going to heat it up, and uh, if it is terrible, I will add my own uh, calorie-less ingredients, uh, herbs, spices, that will make it uh, better. All right, see you guys uh, when that's done. Oh, by the way, we're having spaghetti for lunch. I haven't had spaghetti for lunch in forever. Okay, bye. High five. Wait, I don't high five you now. Ah! Oh, preemptive high five. Mm. And there is our spaghetti. Are you excited to try yes. it out? I am also excited. Now, before we do that, let us compare some things. We buy these. Can you take it out of the package, please? Yeah. These are Tufaya. Tufaya? Yeah, Tufayan bagel lights. My wife loves bagels, so she buys these. One bagel is 100 calories. So it's thin. a pretty decent, uh, it's the same size as a bagel, but thinner. And that's 100 calories. Uh, what else? My ice cream sandwiches from Skinny Cow. This is 130 calories. Oh, put your bagel next to it. Uh, what else? Oh, this Healthy Choice yogurt bar with vanilla yogurt and mango yogurt. 90 calories. <laughs> yeah, put something that's not junk. Uh, let me see. What have we got? What have we got? Uh, I, well, I don't know. I, I, anyway. Anyway. Those things are all 100 calories. 
or 90 calories or 130 calories. And each plate of this spaghetti, 70 calories. Let me let you take a look at that again. That's the bagel next to it. That's 100 calories. Just the bagel. You haven't put anything on it. That's more calories. This ice cream sandwich is 130 calories. That's almost twice as many calories. That ice cream bar, that's 20 calories more than a plate of spaghetti. And I've tasted the sauce and it's delicious. Now we're going to go eat it and we'll give you our final judgments after the crust is off. Alright, so we finished the spaghetti and by we I mean I. My wife didn't like the texture of the noodles with the spaghetti. Huh, sweetheart? Yeah. You didn't like the texture? I love it the tasted sauce. good, but it didn't. No. It didn't feel. No, good. it's like rubbery. Uh, no. 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 It's not doing it. I enjoyed it because I knew that it was going to be rubbery anyway, and it's I. I employed the same mental distraction I do when I eat the spaghetti squash. I know it's not going to taste like spaghetti. Uh, feel like spaghetti. But since it didn't taste like anything, it tasted more like spaghetti than the spaghetti squash did. But yes, it was a little bit rubbery. And I, I, Me, I think it's the smell and you sort of like Well, you, then next time you don't prepare it. Right. Smell like fish a lot. But only when you open it out of the bag. It doesn't smell like fish while you're eating it. So no, it she psyched herself out while she was uh, rinsing them off. So now she's making a sandwich. <laughs> This sandwich looks delicious, and uh, I could actually eat that sandwich now too, because I am allowed that many calories for lunch. But I finished my wife's, so I'm at Not somewhere between 120 and 140, because she did eat some. Uh, yeah, two big bowls of spaghetti. Well, they weren't big bowls. Two small bowls of spaghetti to make one big bowl of spaghetti. That's 140 calories. I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty happy with that. And uh, I, I did like it. Um, it does have a rubbery feel. If you are a texture person and uh, you don't like the texture, then you might not like the, the thing. However, while I was eating it, I was thinking my wife does not, doesn't like it as spaghetti. But I know she would be fine eating it in like a soup. So next time we make uh, the spaghetti noodles, we'll have it in a soup. Of course, we have the fettuccine noodles still to eat. Are you going to be able to have a fettuccine alfredo? <laughs> anyway, when we make that, we'll let you know. Are you enjoying your sandwich? It's delicious? Yeah. How many calories in your sandwich? No, no. The wrap is 110. No. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, these ones are 90. Yeah. So the wrap is 90 calories. And then the meat, uh, the pastrami is uh, two Jimmy slices is 60, so that's 30. And one turkey is 20, so that's uh, uh, 110, 140. And then the Genoa salami is uh, 15, so that's 135. There's and then mustard. there's mustard and mayonnaise. We're looking at a sandwich that's about 150 calories. Uh, at the most. And uh, that's it. Hey, Pickle. You having a good time? You're so cute. All right, that's it for today. Uh, we're going to my in-law's place. No, we're not. We are not going to my in-law's place. We're going to my parents' place. Yeah. Uh, so we're going to go to my parents' place. Uh, if we work out, uh, check out the description below, but we're probably not going to work out. Uh, whoa, hey, I could eat in that. What is wrong with you? What? My wife just threw out the uh, salami <laughs> from her sandwich. Oh, well, you don't like the salami. The salami is badass. It tastes weird. You taste weird. Anyway, uh, see you guys later. High five. Uh, I am at only 25 push-ups today so far. But uh, check the description below, and uh, that'll get updated throughout the day. And by midnight, it should have the right amount of push-ups I did. I did 200 yesterday. I was so psyched. Okay, bye.